Ball State's defensive backfield has a fairly unique build here in 2015. It returns essentially four starters, Martez Hester, Deidre Cromartie, Tyree Holder, and Darius Conaway. But there's also a solid mix of youth. No fewer than five newcomers competing for playing time this fall. Take a look. Deidre Cromartie and uh, you know, Martez Hester, they've been through it before. But those are the only two that have played, you know, and, and that's, that's, that's the, the process that we're going through now is trying to get those guys, Deidre and Martez, to understand that they have to bring those other guys along and give them the experience. Tyree, one corner. Darius at one corner and David's in the mix. So between those three, we'll have two starters come, come our first Thursday and Saturday, and and hopefully, uh, you know, we'll develop some guys. Um, you know, we brought Corey Hall in as a junior college transfer. The two freshmen, Mark Walton and Armani McNulty, I think can be very, very good. Now, of all the DBs, safety Martez Hester is the most veteran, and he's tried to show it this fall. You know, I've definitely stepped up and taken taken a leadership role of the of not just the safeties, the whole the whole de defensive backs groups. And once you play, you know that that puts that puts a little bit more responsibility on you. Tyree Holder, the most senior of the corner group. Liking what he's seen so far. Just the will to compete. You can't you can't coach competing and we, we compete. That's one thing we do get out there. It's basically just the pride. I mean, are you gonna let the man in front of you beat you or not? That's basically what it comes down to. You don't want the man in front of you, uh, the man lined up in front of you to beat you. As for all the new names, three of them are junior college transfer safeties. Terrence Solomon's doing a really good job. Uh, he's learning every day. You know, obviously he's got he's got ways to go. It's not, well, only been practice 12, but he's learning every day. Um, you can see certain things in his game that's getting better every day. Kyle Lewis is in that mix, and then Rontrell Payton, who was actually here in the spring, is in that mix. Morrison also mentioning the two fresh corners. They're freshmen in Armani McNulty and Mark Walton. I told them both that you'll have the opportunity. What you do with that opportunity is going to be entirely up to you and and and. So I'm trying not to put pressure on them, but at the same time, I know if they're competitors and they want to play, they're going to put their best foot forward. Um, those two have come in and put their best foot forward. That's kind of rare. You, you come in and see a freshman coming in right away, compete with the ones and the twos. So that's always a positive. And then for myself, it pushes me and the, uh, and the other uh, starters to be on our game. But personnel aside, the safety job at least boils down to one pretty big responsibility. We're trying to beat the QBs of the defense, basically. Uh, make sure everybody's lined up right. Uh, make sure everybody knows what they're doing, make sure the communication is, uh, you know, on point with everybody. And the corners are not far behind. Just everybody just constantly making plays every day, you know what I mean? It may not be me one play, but then it's the, uh, the opposite corner, the next making them play, and we feed off the positive energy from each other.